New at 11 tonight, stray cats are turning up with horrific and life-threatening injuries, all of them found in the same neighborhood in Queens. Now, some of these images are just so graphic, we can't even show them to you. News for Zyda Siegel in Richmond Hill tonight to explain why rescuers say these animals might have been tortured. Oh, it's injured, too. This tiny cat is a stray who hangs out on 102nd Avenue in Queens. Over a week ago, local rescuers noticed her leg shaking and her paw bleeding. A closer look revealed all four of her paws had devastating injuries, some of them so severe the bones were completely exposed. Megan LeCarrie at Puppy Kitty New York City agreed to take her in. And we're like, maybe she got stuck in something, maybe it was like a crushing injury, um, and we just had her transported to the hospital where she still is. But then things got even more disturbing and mysterious. Two more cats were discovered in the same location with identical injuries. A huge red flag. This was not an accident. Oh my God, what did they go through? Like, how did this happen? And, you know, their pain, because you, you could see it in their face, you know, it's just, and they're shaking and... It was horrible. Megan says she reached out to the police and a detective has been communicating with her. At this point, she says they told her there are no leads. However, the vet who is treating the cats believes they all suffered a chemical burn. I'm worried about abuse. Um, I don't know if it's against the cats directly or if someone's throwing chemicals to deter all animals. All three cats were taken to Long Island Veterinary Specialist Hospital, their paws bandaged up. But the second cat they found, Ruby, couldn't be saved. My vet said, you know, the only way that she would be okay is if we amputated all four limbs, which is not really a quality of life for a four-legged animal. Now they're fighting to save the others. Juliet's hospital bill is already at $7,000. Megan fears they may never find out who did this or why. Ruby's body has been sent to a lab for further testing. Reporting from Richmond Hill, Ida Siegel, News 4, New York.